Peace. Really, really quick. I just wanted to show you guys a triple action reversing spell that I'm doing for a client. I want to say this really quick. I find that a lot of y'all wait until people, the enemy, people in your life strike for you to want to take action for shit. And I want to say this. Stop being a victim. Stop being a victim. Stop waiting for people to do things to you so now you can sit in victim mode and you can sit in everything that they have done to you and da 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 and rah 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 without taking people for who they are and taking their actions for who they are and being 100% okay with being like, you know what? This individual is a fucked up person. This individual is showing me exactly who they are. So now I'm going to show their asses who they are. Does that make sense? Don't be a victim. Don't 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 be that person that waits around for life to smack you upside your head and to smack you in your face for you to finally want to realize things. Take people for base value and take them for who they are. Now, to get into this really quick, this is a triple action reversing spell that is worked for nine days or at least seven days as long however long the candle is is um goes for usually i like to work this for at least nine days or seven days in addition to that i have a mirror box spell that i'm doing for a client and this is going to be worked for nine days definitely with nine black candles this is not sending negativity to anybody by any means this mirror box spell is simply to reverse every single negative thought every evil eye every Anything that has been sent to you negatively, that has been sent to you with a negative mindset, that has been sent to you with evil eye, that has been sent to you with, that has been sent to destroy you and destroy who you are as a person, in this box. This is broke. I want to show you guys really quick. Because this is one of my favorite spells. A lot of people think that you have to get into black magic and dark magic. You don't got none of that shit. When an enemy feels like they want to strike and they want to start sending shit your way, all you need to do is transmute that shit and send it right the fuck back. So in here, I have some spellbreaker herbs. Not a lot, just a little bit of spellbreaker herbs. And then I have broken up mirrors. And the back side, I have the back side of a, um, what is it called? Of aluminum foil. You want to get the shiny side, not the other part. You want to get the shiny side that reflects. So every single fucking negative thing that they're sending you, you send it back nine times. Even on this paper right here. I don't even have any names written because I don't need to have names written. I don't need to. People know what they do and people know their intentions. I don't need to write the names. But if you have, if you know your enemy's name, what you can do is you can write it on this paper nine times. Write the enemy's name nine times. Then what you do is, of course, you turn it this way. You turn it right. Then you write your name over it nine times. And then what you want to do is you want to spit on this. And what that represents is you dominating them. You sending every single thing back to them that they're sending to you times nine. And you want to make sure that you really put emphasis on time nine. Because you don't just want it to come in easily and lightly. You want that shit to hit them like a motherfucking volcano. Okay? So what I have in here is made um, all evil eyes sent my way be returned times nine. Then I have another petition that just basically says um, this is... From a, I forgot which psalm this is, but it says, When he is tired, let him come forth guilty. Let his prayers be counted as sin. You understand what I'm saying? Because when people send you evil eye, most likely and most of the times, it is rooted in envy. And envy is one of the deadly sins that is rooted in the heart. Boom. So now, you done that? You worked this for nine days with Psalm 59. Say that shit nine times from the bottom of your chest. Call in your ancestors. Call in your guardians, your guides. You don't need to petition any spirits. I find a lot of y'all petitioning too much fucking spirits just for the sake of saying I'm working with a spirit. Stop petitioning these spirits. Get your power up. Work on you. Nine days. Look at how this, look at the burns on this. This is spirit saying that they're all over the situation. Notice how it has burned to the, the future side. Spirit is saying they're all over this. And anybody who has sent shit your way is going to get it back. So you have nine candles. You want to work this for nine days. Then what I have here is I have three reversing candles. Look at all that white suit on that candle. The candle isn't even done burning yet. Look at all of this white suit. This is spirit saying they are on top of all of this. This reversing candle is for any evil eye that has been sent your way. Look at all the white suit that is on top of that. All of that white suit, it, has, it usually comes white up here and black. And the white represents cleansing and purifying you from the evil eye and the negativity that's been sent your way. And the black is reversing it, sending it right the fuck back. This is usually for your businesses, for your, for your money, for any 
usually people, the way they like to hit you is by affecting your money. They want to destroy your monetary gain, your monetary value. This is a reversing candle for your money. So any evil eye that has been sent your way as far as your business is, your, your, your job, that's what that candle is for. This reversing candle is usually for as a general reversing candle for any negativity that's been sent your way, period. Usually it has the black up here to get rid of the um, negativity and then the red. Or usually sometimes it'll come red and black. Both the same shit, whatever. Under here I have the client's petition, the name, and I also have their picture. That's it. Simple spell. What you can do is Psalms 59. Say that nine times from the bottom of your chest. You want to work that gut up. You want to say it with power. Not out of scarcity. Not out of, uh, out of being scared. You want to say that shit with power from the gut. Okay? Psalms 59. Once you do Psalms 59, another prayer that you can do is you can also do Psalms 7 verses 1 through 10. Say that nine times over all three candles. Psalm 7, say that um, verses 1 through 9. I mean, verses 1 through 10, say that nine times. Then also you can do Psalms 109, verses 7 and 12. Over this candle nine times for nine days until it goes out. Notice how the red candle is burning. All of these candles were lit on the same day. All of them. The red candle is burning faster. The red on the bottom draws back in that luck. Which is why I like it when it's black up here and then red down here. Because the black is removing that negativity. The, the red is drawing it in. Look at this candle and look at... Notice how sooty it is up here. You want to see that from candles like this. You want to see the suit around this because you want to see that spirit is on top of the situation and it's removing it. You want to see that down here is burning clear because that is drawing back in that good luck, that, that the, the good luck that is trying to be taken from you. So down here, you want to see that candle burning clear. Let's say you burn these candles and all these shits burn black as fuck. It burns black down here. It burns black down here. It burns all the way black. That is a message from spirit that the person that is working against you has done some powerful shit against you. And you're going to need more than reversing. You're going to need to uncross. You're going to need spiritual baths. You're going to need to cleanse your mind, your body, your soul. You're going to need a zen. <laughs> you feel me? Nikki voice. You're going to need to zen your body. You had to abstain from sex just to zen my body. You're going to need to zen that body and get rid of the negativity that's being sent to you. Anyway, I hope this helped. This is a nine or seven day reversing candle spell. Simple, simple, simple spell that can be done. Um, Ashe, peace.